Hello, welcome to Epiphany Hobbies. Uh, for any products similar to this or for your hero clicks needs, uh, feel free to check out www.chaoscards.co.uk, linked to which is in the description below. Uh, today we are doing the uh, Superior Foes of Spider Man. As you can see, I'm already gloved up and ready to go. Uh, I've got my usual three bricks, uh, I've got a full case and then just a sole brick on itself. So, this is the brick that I got separately, so I'll just throw the other two to the side for the minute and we will uh, check those out shortly and I will also quickly just throw my phone to the side so it stops making a noise Right, so, um, stuff I'm wanting out of these They have got the new um, variants where they're basically kind of like all white with like a wash uh, I don't think there's anything on the sides uh, There is a lot of the villains that I like in Spider-Man I'm not a big Spider-Man fan but I do like the villains, so I am looking forward to this. Obviously, we've got the uh, the clicks FX bases again. Um, so I'm just basically going to get stuck in. We're going to see what we get. Um, like I say, I want, I want some of the villains. The chasers are all Spider Man, so not massively fussed. Uh, but there is some nice looking ones. Uh, so let's just, let's just get stuck in and see what we get. Of course, usual, I've cut all the tape and everything, so we're good to go. Okay, so these have got the uh, the new style cards, and they've also got this nice bit of polystyrene or whatever you want to call it that we've decided to uh, start shoving in now, just to make it more challenging. I suppose it works as a nice little backdrop actually. Spin these around a bit. Right, so what we got here. I can't read any of the names because of the stupid bit of plastic. As you can tell, I should have probably peeked inside these and checked this out first, so I knew that I needed to uh, dispose of this uh, post or anything. Right, let's try again. Take two. Uh, right, so our rare is uh, Mephisto. We've got Jackal, we've got Hobgoblin, who's a unique, quite like that guy. Uh, we have got Stiltman. Now I believe if you get a bunch of these stilt men you can like make a really tall one because obviously it's like modular. Uh, and then we've got Spider Girl. These as well have got the uh, the new style cards where you actually get the whole uh, dial printed on the cards. You know what's coming so if you can't decide whether to push or not you can have a quick look see what powers you're going to push on to or see if you're going to kill yourself. So they are pretty good. Some people don't like it. I think it's it's useful for um, for team building and stuff like that to be honest because you're not going to click through all the dial, you're not going to mess about, you can just have a quick look at the card. Okay. Oh, we are going to get this annoying cost iron all the way through I think. So we've got a quick effect bit, which I'll just move out of the way. We'll work out what that belongs to later. Oh, it probably belongs to Superior Spider-Man. Who is... I believe a super rare, but I might be wrong here. It could be a chase, and I could be just not getting excited for nothing. Uh, we've then got Cottonmouth. Uh, quite like the look of that guy. We have got Shocker. Uh, Betty Bryant and Cape Killer. Actually quite like a Cape Killer, he looks pretty cool. Again there's going to be a bunch of characters as usual that I am not familiar with. But it's a learning kit. Now I've got some uh, interesting comments in this one. So we have got Chameleon, who's looking into like a mirror. We have got Death Adder, he's again our super rare. We've got Vermin, uh, we have got J. Jonah Jameson, and we have got a thug. It's quite a cool looking thug actually. Mm. 
love this stupid polystyrene stuff, I'm sure I am. So we have got NYPD Officer, we have got Rattler, again yeah, quite a local Rattler. Uh, we've got another Stiltman, uh, we have got Anaconda, and then our first variant is the uh, Frogman. So he's a rare by the looks of it. Um, now I believe the, the variants are slightly more rare if that makes sense. So it's going to go like rare, rare variant, super rare, super rare variant. So uh, a lot of people don't like them. I think they look quite cool. It doesn't really bother me. Some of them have got good paint jobs anyway, some of them don't. So it's kind of potluck, it depends what you like. I know some people have just been trading them away because they really don't like them. I mean, the temptation is for people like me to try and then get a full set of the variants. I've managed to restrain myself from uh, from it so far. Okay, let's see what we've got here. Okay, so we've got the Spider-Man. Obviously, it's his set, so we've got that one. We've got a variant for Black Mamba. So that's just a common. Uh, obviously, they print the rarity in black because it's a white base. Uh, we have got a Venom. We have got Overdrive, and we have got Carnage as our rare, which is quite a nice sculpt as well. As usual, I'll uh, get all these out at the end. I can get a full overview of everything I got. We have got Dagger, we have got Tarantula, uh, we've got a variant Uncommon Jackal, looks a bit like Gollum to me, um, we've got Norman Osborne, and we have got a rare Moon Knight. So, not far finishing this brick off. Doing that as well. I'm gonna keep popping them out by accident with the uh, rather annoying polystyrene. Okay, we have got Spider Man again, we have got a Cape Killer, we have got a Prime now, we have got Prime uh, Anti Venom, so he's the uncommon Prime, so it's quite a nice one. Pretty happy with him. Uh, Mr. Hyde. Uh, one of my friends actually played this against me recently, and it was a lot better than I thought it was. Quite uh, it takes quite a beating. Um, and then we have got Beetle. Some nice little sculpts in there. Green Goblin, I quite like Green Goblin, Shocker, uh, Mary Jane, and then we've got Super Rare Craven. That's quite a cool one, up on top of his uh, looks like a little concrete pillar type thing. Right, two to go. Uncommon variant of Spider Girl. We have got Rattler again. We have got a Toxin, which I don't believe we've had yet. Uh, we've got Silk again, I don't think we've had her. And then our rare is Electro, which I think is a very nice one. Quite like that. Oh, 
last one for this brick. Oh, just destroying the place in the process of uh, removing the polystyrene. Okay, we have got Spider Man, we have got J. Jonah Jameson, we have got Betty Brandt, we have got a different Spider Man. And then we've got somebody with a massive cloak, cold cloak. There's a genius comment for you right there. Um, <laughs> those are rare. Okay, so we're on to the, the two bricks now that I got as a case. Uh, so let's see what we get in these. Apart from more polystyrene. I'm sure somebody's going to make a comment about how it's not polystyrene, it's something else. But whatever it is, it's really annoying. So we've got another FX uh, little thing. We've got Spider-Man, we've got JJ and Jameson, Tarantula, Toxin, and then we've got Super uh, Spider-Gwen. So I'm guessing the uh, FX thing goes with her. Here we go. Uh, JJ and Jameson again. We've got Kingpin, which I don't believe we've had one yet, Shocker, uh, Mr. Hyde, and then we've got Super Rare Baron Zemo, which again is a nice, uh, a nice one. Again, my friend uh, played this guy in the same team with Mr. Hyde, and uh, he was pretty good as well, so I'm quite looking forward to uh, giving him a test run. Interesting already. And, uh, it away. So we have got Betty Brandt, uh, the variant version. We have got Vermin. Mm, I think we've only had the. Uh, we had Vermin? We might have had the variant, we haven't had the normal one. Uh, we have got Scarlet Spider, which again we've not had. Vermin. Uh, vermin. Venom. The other guy's vermin. Um, and then Mysterio. Which actually, I think looks really nice. It's really good uh, detail on that one. So it looks like we're getting another variant in this uh, it'd make it easier as well if we didn't sellotape the polystyrene in um, right so we have got black mamba we've got another stilt man we've got silk we've then got an uncommon variant of night watch which is quite a nice one it looks actually pretty cool as uh, in the variant and then we've got a rare uh, puff adder Rather unfortunate name, but looks quite cool. So I'm quite looking forward to trying him out as well. I'm liking these, like the, all the villains that you're getting in here. Um, should make some interesting sort of teams and stuff. Um, so can maybe have a nice uh, evil couple of teams to fight off against some Avengers or something like that. I've got another variant. So we're doing alright on the uh, on the variant front. So we've got an uncommon variant of uh, Cape Killer. So again, that looks quite cool again. Uh, we've got Dagger. We've got Death Adder. We've got Hobgoblin. And our rare is uh, Tiger Shark. I quite like these sort of like... Um, sort of, I don't know how to describe the costumes. It's kind of like how I envisage it if you're, like, you're playing a computer game. You were designing your superhero. Sort of a classic look. I quite like that.
I won't mind this so much if they actually didn't put all the characters in the booster box facing the polystyrene. Just want to have to uh, take it out. Right, let's see what we've got in here. We've got Black Mamba, Kingpin, uh, Anaconda, Norman Osborn, and our rare is Vulture, who we've not got yet. I will try to complain the whole video about the polystyrene if I can help. Maybe just like the last 30 seconds. So we've got JG and Jameson, we've got Shocker, we've got Scorpion. Uh, again, I like that one, we've not had him yet, even though he's an uncommon. Uh, Mr. Hyde, and then our rare is Lizard, and it's a variant as well. So that's quite a nice one. The thing with the variants though, it does make me curious as to what the actual paint job looks like if you get the normal one. We've got the, the common prime of uh, Captain Stacy. Uh, we have got another thug. We've got Green Goblin. We have got Jackal. And our rare is uh, Speed Demon. And somebody gets a special SF, yeah, an SFX uh, bit of plastic to go with them. So I'll work out who that belongs to at some point. in here as well. So we've got Betty Brandt, we've got Shocker, we have got Cotton Mouth, uh, we have got Rare Mephisto, and then it looks like we've also got the Chase Spider Knight. So actually out of this one brick I've got a Prime and a Chase, so I'm pretty happy with that. And it's quite a cool one actually, I quite like the look at that. So even though I wasn't really fussed about the chases because they're all Spider-Man oriented, the one I've got I do really like. <laughs> In fact, let's have a quick look on the other side. Oh, the shield's got the, uh, the Spider-Man logo on, I like that. Okay, so last booster for this brick. So we've got two primes and a chase so far. And we've still got a brick to go, so hopefully... We'll get another prime or another chase out of there, and hopefully it won't be one we've already got. I seem to have a habit of getting uh, the ones I already have. Okay, so we have got Cape Killer, we have got Spider Girl, we've got Vermin, we've got Overdrive, and then we've got Super Rare, Superior Spider-Man. So the guy who set it is. <laughs> That's quite it's a, quite a good one as well. So that was a nice one to finish this brick on. So on to the last and final brick. Let's uh, see what we can get here. Well, we've got all the oh we haven't got uh, Doctor Octopus yet, have we? So we haven't got Doctor Octopus, and we haven't got this guy whose name I've forgotten. I think we've got all the other villains off the box. Right, we have got NYPD officer. I don't think we've actually got one of these, we've only got the prime version of it so far. Uh, Cape Killer, Vermin, uh, Silk, and then our super rare is Chameleon again. So hopefully I'll be able to trade him for another super rare. Because he's unique as well, so there's no point keeping two of him. For those who don't know what the unique thing is, it's the silver ring around the base. And basically means you can only have one in your team. Uh, so there's never any point in having more than one in your collection. Ok, 
Okay, so we've got Black, Black Mamba, we have got Thug, we have got Betty Brandt, we have got Night Watch, so we haven't actually got, well I have got this guy, but it was a variant, and then uh, Super Ares Ares, so that's a nice one as well. I'm guessing the, uh, the base there is his. got J. Gina Jameson, we have got a variant of Rattler, we have got Anaconda, we've got Overdrive and then we've got another Beetle. Spider-Man, we have got Cape Killer, we've got Green Goblin, Mr. Hyde, and then our rare is Carnage. I'm running out of space. fashion for me it's the one I've already got <laughs> we've got spider-man uh, tarantula we've got anti-venom so hopefully I can uh, trade him for something else I need uh, Norman Osborn and then a rare electro Variant of an NYPD officer. We have got Stiltman, uh, Death Adder, Anaconda, and our rare is Frogman. So we've got the variant of him, and now we've got the, uh, the normal one. So we've had so far three primes and a chase. So we could get lucky and get another uh, another chase in here. But we've already had a prime, so I'm not going to be devastated if we don't. Uh, we've got Rattler, Green Goblin, Tarantula, Jackal, and Rare Lizard. So I'll last three boosters now. Looks like we've got another. Uh, Variant. So we have got Thug, uh, Rattler, Stiltman, uh, we've got a variant of Silk, was an uncommon, and then our rare is Black Cat, which is actually quite a nice little one because uh, she's like breaking into a safe. So I quite like that. So the last two boosters. We, uh, we get out of these. Oh, looks like I've got another variant coming our way. And somebody just committed suicide off there, so I'll have to retrieve them shortly. Uh, Black Mamba, Spider Girl, Mary Jane, Cotton Mouth, and we've got a rare variant of Mephisto. which is actually really cool because on the crystal I'll pop this out now actually and give you a good look at it I've only just realised this but on his little crystal ball it, uh, there is actually like a, a picture of a guy I'm guessing this guy's like important or works at WizKids or something but I'm not in the know I'm afraid that is really cool. OK, 
Okay, so it looks like we have got another variant. And our uh, last and final uh, booster. So we've got Spider Man, Green Goblin, Dagger, uh, Scorpion, and then I've got a Super Rare, Power Man, and Iron Fist variant. So that's pretty cool. Right, so that's everything. I'll get it all out so you can have a good look. And I'll be back in two seconds. Okay, so here we are. I've uh, had a count up and the number of variants I got was uh, 13. So I've got 13 variants all together. Uh, Spider-Man number one was the uh, most common one. Uh, there's a couple of the commons, uh, well, a couple, I'll say there's one. Uh, Kingpin, where I actually got two of him in the whole lot, and then there's one of the uncommons where I only, uh, sorry, two of the uncommons where I only got one of them. Uh, so here's the all are. I've just left the variants dotted in as I've uh, got them out. Uh, Stiltman's made up there. I didn't bother making up the other four because I'm going to trade those away. And then we've got the uncommons. So you see, I've got a couple of the. Uh, I think three variants in the uncommons. I've got six of the commons. And then behind there we have the uh, the rares. Really like that Mysterio. I'm going to have to look at his card after this and uh, see what he's like. So in the rares I got uh, three variants. And then got the super rares where it's got the one variant I did end up with two spare super rares that I'll have to look to trade away and then prime wise uh, I got three primes but two were duplicates unfortunately and then I got the, the chase uh, spider knight so I was pretty happy with the stuff there I'm looking forward to playing the villains uh, trying them out um, so yeah, that's going to be it. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot more unboxings. There's going to be a few more diversified uh, videos coming soon. Uh, the channel is going to improve rapidly, hopefully. I'm looking to put a lot of work in. So please like and subscribe. Please share the video. The more viewers I get, it really does help build the channel. Um, and thank you. So uh, I look forward to seeing you all next time, guys. It's been Epiphany Hobbies. And uh, keep clicking.